Hi guys, so are you ready to draw with me today? So today I'm gonna draw a goldfish. This is a request that I got from Tasho. So I hope you like it Tasho. So here we go. So if you are new to this channel, I put out a video every day. So don't forget to hit that subscribe button and hit that bell icon down below so I can keep posting these drawings and other videos for you every single day. So we are going to start off with the head of the fish. So we are going to draw the lips first and build from there. So think of this as a little oval head and a round body and another oval. So that's the shape that we are going for. So I will show you exactly how to draw this but in your head just keep in mind that the head part of it would be a little oval shape and then the body is going to be a little round and the tail area is going to be a little round before you add the tail so the, I'm talking about just the body so I'm going to add the eyes here they have a big eye a circle and another circle inside and then build to the body as you go down uh, the body So if you want this drawing as a color page, let me know. I will send it to you. Uh, just comment below and let me know. Also comment below and let me know if you have any other requests for me to draw. Uh, so I will draw that and show it to you so you can draw that as well. And uh, either send it to me or keep it. This one is going to be put on a t-shirt and other products so if you want to uh, see how it turns out in um, merchandise check out the red bubble link down below in the description box there are coasters and um, many other products um, so check it out if you want goldfish themed uh, room you have a lot of products in there that you can buy so check those out Today to color the goldfish I'm going to use watercolor pencils because I felt like it will be a good fit for the goldfish. So if you want to buy watercolor pencils that are very high quality and um, want to buy it from a place uh, that has it for less check out the link below uh, in the description box for Artisa Art Supplies. You can use the promo code CANDO10 if you like uh, to get more sales uh, and deals and check out the link below for you to buy these products. They are about um, I believe 16 to 20 dollars and you will get that discount as well and these are really nice products. And the reason why I'm saying this is if you are interested in uh, coloring with watercolors and things like that, this is a good way to get into watercolors because you're just drawing it with a color pencil and then adding water at the end. So uh, this is a good way to learn how to deal with the watercolors and how to um, blend colors with watercolors. See, now you see that the body is an oval shape, a round and an oval shape and also the tail is going to be a big tail because goldfishes have uh, huge tails. So draw it a little bigger to the body of the fish um, and then it has different like um, fins. Uh, not just two uh, so add that as well like I'm doing here and then you're done with the fish so and I'm gonna add a little bit of a background just uh, one or two seaweeds and some stones just to go around the fish but you can add other fish and uh, water bubbles and uh, any other um, anything that you would like and also you know what you can also add it to a water tank you can add a water tank and some pebbles and water and seaweed you can do that so I hope you like this video so stay tuned to see how I color it and I also have two amazing drawings to show you these are from a very very talented artist 
and um, i can't wait to share these with you i'm sure you're going to love it as well so stay tuned for that um so what i'm doing here is i'm adding to the fish uh, just the fins and everything so you can do the same so you can get a nice uh, uh, outline before you start coloring so add a little bit whatever you think is missing check the fish um, if you are satisfied with it or add to it as you go and just um, whatever you think is missing just around go around the lines that you drew and make it a little darker and add a little uh, extra um, material to the body if you like so you can add accordingly just like what I'm doing here so I hope you like this video guys so if you do like it don't forget to hit that like button and and don't forget to leave a comment for me and let me know how I'm doing and you, if you like this video and how do you like this fish and if you want to see any other fishes let me know as well so now I'm going to add a pebble and uh, I'm going to add another pebble and then I'm going to add the seaweed so I will add the other pebble later on uh, so you can add the seaweed just like I'm doing here or you can add any other background that you like to make it your own and color it as you like as well. I will show you how to color my goldfish if you want to draw it exactly like I am drawing and uh, I will share that with you. Like I said, easy way to draw um, and add uh, watercolors is to use watercolor pencils. So I will show you exactly how I use watercolor pencils so you know and you can see how easy they are to be used. So a fun fact about goldfish is that they don't have teeth so what they do is they crush their food um, in their throat as it goes. So if you have a goldfish at home as a pet or if you are thinking of buying a goldfish um, the lifespan of a goldfish in a bowl uh, is very uh, limited compared to an aquarium. So uh, lifespan of a goldfish in a bowl is short to about 5 years whereas a goldfish living indoors in an aquarium can live up to 10 years. And if you keep them outside in water in a garden or a pond if you have a garden or a pond outside your house and you want to put the goldfish in there they might live up to 20 years sometimes even up to 30 to 40 years so that's very interesting maybe they get uh, lonely and claustrophobic inside the bowl I don't know I'm just thinking um, but I always felt like they must be feeling really busy when they just go around a tiny ball all around. Uh, so let me know what you think in the comment section. Do you feel the same or do you like the idea of having uh, a little fish in a bowl? Um, I love how they look though in a little bowl. They look beautiful. It's like a decorative item that you can put inside your house, um, inside your room or something because they are very beautiful and you can add little cute uh, pebbles and like other stuff into the bowl or your aquarium and make it look really nice and they are beautiful, the orange and gold looking so it really adds to a room when you have a goldfish. You just have to feed it every day and take care of it and clean the bowl, that's all. And also if you're thinking of buying a goldfish and or if you have a goldfish and um, you don't know this fact um, goldfish when they sleep they keep their eyes open because they don't even have eyelids so if you have a goldfish and you're wondering why it's not sleeping all day this is why they are sleeping but they can close their eyes because they don't have eyelids so that is why they keep looking at you so you see here how I'm coloring it I'm using dark oranges and shades of oranges and yellows I'm going over the whole fish and uh, the around the lines where I drew the lines with the sharpie or you drew it with the pencil I go darker and then 
um, everywhere else I'm going to make it lighter and lighter as I go and uh, add to the body as well so don't forget to take the time to hit the subscribe button and the bell icon down below so I can bring a video for you every single day and share these with you every single day and uh, I hope you like my videos and I love bringing them to you also if you can and if you like please hit the like button and leave a comment for me and as always send me a request and I will draw that and show it to you and this is a uh, request that I got from Tasho like I said before and I hope you like it Tasho and you can do the same by commenting below and letting me know what you want to see next and you want to see any other fish as well so I have a shark that I drew before you can check that out as well I'll put that in the i button up top so you can check that out once you're done with the, the goldfish and um, like I said I have an amazing drawing to show you as well I have two drawings to show you uh, these are very talented artists I love getting the drawings from you guys so if you like to send me your drawing as well I put the information in the description box for you to send me the drawing so I can show it to everyone uh, in my next videos and uh, share with everyone how talented you guys are so um, yeah send it to me uh, the information is in the description box um, and it's a good practice to sign your work every time so uh, people can see who drew it so here I uh, wrote my name can do and uh, you just need a little bit of water with the uh, paintbrush and then go over it just like I'm doing here so go over it uh, all over the whole fish and then as you need get water but don't get too much so you won't uh, soak the paper uh, but just add a little bit of water at a time and keep shading keep blending the colors with the colors that you added and uh, make sure you get the uh, amount of shade and the brightness that you want and now I have these amazing drawings to show you the first one is the chicken uh, that Tasho sent very very beautiful thank you very much for sending this you are so so talented and I also have another drawing to show you from Tasho and uh, if you want to draw this chicken um, and learn how to draw it check out the i button up top i will put the tutorial in there for you to go and check out after this video and the next one is also from tasho this is the hedgehog beautiful drawing very nicely done thank you very much for sending this i love getting your drawings and everyone else's so keep sending me these drawings whenever you guys can i will share them with everyone and you can also draw this hedgehog by following the i button up top i will put the video of the hedgehog as well so you can follow the tutorial and this is the final color drawing of the goldfish i hope you like it if you do like it you know what to do hit that like button and leave a comment for me and any requests that you have you can let me know i will draw that for you as well and watch the next videos to see more cute drawings and learn how to draw things and like always don't forget to subscribe and share my videos with your friends and with everyone so i can keep bringing videos to you every single day and i will see you tomorrow